Welcome to today's Big Brother 16 updates and spoilers. We have two house guests of the day, Real Awesome and Renita Vega. And Renita is a fellow Sovereign Six fan. Yeah! I so miss those days of like the two big alliances, like battling it out. It'd be nice to see that again. But anyway, as I've been talking about a lot recently, Victoria has been campaigning relentlessly. Not just campaigning, begging. So it's really awkward at this point. Uh, there's one incident in particular that I want to talk about. All three of them were hanging out in the living room. Victoria and Derek were lying on the floor. Cody was on one of the couches. And Victoria's like, Derek! If he wins, like, she wants him to take her to Greece. Homer, what happened? Come on. So she's like, Derek, if you win, you have to take me to Greece. And Derek is like, well, what if you win? And she's like, oh, well, take me to the final two, and then I can. <laughs> so Derek and Cody were just like, uh -huh. But then it got really bad because she starts begging Derek and Cody to put their loving hands out, baby. Just kidding. Begging them to bring her to the final two. She's like, I will do anything. And she was telling them, like, you will definitely win against me. Like, how can you not be thinking about taking me to the end? So Derek is just like, Victoria, your mom is not going to like seeing you begging like this. Like, it's, it's not a good look. So she's just like, oh, whatever. So then she's asking Cody, Cody, will you take me to the end? And he's like, I literally would never. And you know how he always says literally. And then he was like, why would I cross Derek? Seriously, though, Derek is like the father figure. And there have been so many house guests this season who are like afraid of disappointing him or upsetting him. It's ridiculous because most of these people are in their early to mid 20s and Derek is only like 31. Oh my gosh. So you can tell at this point the guys are getting pretty pissed off at Victoria. She's... She's making it really awkward. So Cody's like, well, we worked really hard to get where we are right now. You know, kind of implying that Victoria hasn't really worked as hard. And, you know, maybe she hasn't. But still, he's, he's fuming. So Derek and Cody later on are outside in the backyard playing their millionth pool game. Seriously, that's all they've been doing. So they're venting about Victoria, and Cody's like, oh, it's this close to calling her out. I'm going to call her out. And Derek is like, don't do it. Don't get in trouble in the last, like, two or three days. Because, you know, production doesn't want them telling Victoria that she's not going to the final two. They want that reaction on the finale. So Cody is like, I wish that I could just straight up tell Victoria that she's not going to the final two because she doesn't deserve to go. Ouch. So, today, Derek and Victoria were hanging out, and Derek started counting out his jury votes with Victoria, and Victoria's like, oh, Derek, you're definitely gonna win, and it seems like Derek knows that he has the votes. He's worried about Donnie and Joe Costa, um, Christine is kind of a gray area because they don't know if she's gonna be like weirded out by the whole booing situation and vote against Cody or if she's gonna vote for Cody or what the deal is with that but it's pretty clear that Derek is gonna have the votes so it's just even more obvious like Cody wake up I've never really been a Cody fan but at this point I'm like gonna be embarrassed for him if he wins the final HOH and brings Derek and then loses. That's just so sad. Um, when he could easily bring Victoria to the final two and definitely win. Um, but yeah, so <laughs> that's sad um, because I'm pretty sure that Cody would definitely take Derek to the final two. So today, Big Brother gave them their suitcases so that they could start packing. And I feel like I remember Derek talking about this early on in the season, how he brought a pack of cigarettes with him to use a strategy just in case there were smokers in the house, you know, some like bartering or whatever. Um, but he never really had to bring them out because there were no smokers this season, at least not cigarettes anyway. Um, but <laughs> yeah, so um, I thought that was kind of interesting. I feel like somebody else did that another season too. I don't know if it was Arlie on Big Brother 
Canada season two? It might have been him or somebody else. I don't know, but I feel like it was Arlie. Um, if you know, leave it in the comments. But yeah, Derek is packing his things up already. I think this is the first time he's had to pack his things, right? Because he's never been on the block, which you gotta admit is quite an accomplishment, especially with the twist this season with four people going up. It is an accomplishment. I'll give it to him, but I'm still not really a Derek fan. I don't know. Let me know what you guys think. Tomorrow is finale eve. Woo! So definitely come back tomorrow. And until then, much love. Edit.